The Outlander writers threw quite a curveball at viewers in the season 4 finale, titled Man of Worth, when a rather surprising hookup took place, one that had book readers gasping in delight. Read on to find out what's next for this new couple, but be warned of spoilers if you haven't yet watched the episode. In the finale, while Jamie, Sam Hewen, and Claire, Katrina Balf, are busy rescuing Roger, Richard Rankin, and Brianna, Sophie Skelton, is occupied with, you know, having a baby and all, Murtaugh, Duncan LaCroix, and Joe Casta, Maria Doyle Kennedy, find themselves arguing about the state of the American colonies as controlled by the British. And suddenly they're sleeping together. Ever since it was revealed that Murtaugh was alive and well, and didn't die at Culloden, as the character does in the books, fans have speculated about the part he'll play in the series moving forward. A large contingent of them have theorized that Murtaugh would take the place of Duncan Innes, a man who in the book marries Joe Casta in large part so that other would-be suitors with less than upstanding intentions stop sniffing around her fortune. But executive producer Tony Graffia told Pop Suger that the Murtaugh Joe Casta romance is not simply a case of one character replacing another. Our decision to keep Myrtle alive because we love that character so much says in and of itself that he deserves his own story and he's not just here to replace another character, Graffia explained. He's going to have his own story and his own arc that plays out with Joe Casta and there are some surprises there, I would say. It's not as formulaic as he is just going to take someone's place. However, she did reveal that originally the romance was going to be more of a slow burn until they were writing the finale and decided the two fiery characters just needed to go for it. We always talked about getting them together because we felt that even though that's not something from the books, it would be very organic, Graffia said. Myrtle was in love with, Jamie's mother, Ellen and it was unrequited love, he never got to have her. Even though he got to have Jamie, he got a godson out of it, he's never even had a marriage or a relationship. He's always been this kind of roguish character, but in our minds, we've always thought from the beginning it would be really cool if Joe Casta had a little crush on him all along, but had to watch from the sidelines because he was in love with her sister. Graffia added that they always imagined Murtaugh and Joe Casta being more right for each other but also having a very contentious relationship. They're more like oil and water, they were very spicy and spirited and had a very turbulent relationship. But in the end, they have a huge respect for each other and are drawn to each other, Graffia said. We had planned to do a more slow rollout, where he hangs out at River Run and it happens slowly. But when I was working on the finale, I talked about it with, fellow EPs, Matt Roberts and with Meryl Davis and we just kind of decided you know what? Let's just put him in bed. Let's just get him together, let's just make this happen. We knew it would be a surprise to everyone. Graffio also revealed that she almost jokingly said to the writer's room that she imagined the two fighting and Joe Casta throwing whiskey in his face and then boom, they're in bed together, and everyone loved that idea so much, that's what they went with. They're just not the sentimental type, those two. So I said the only way I could get him in bed is they have a fight and maybe she like throws a whiskey in his face and then we just cut to their in bed and everyone's like, yeah, that's the way to do it. Graffia said with a laugh. I was just kind of throwing that out there, as how I would imagine it, and everyone's like, let's just play it that way, let's do exactly that. So that's the way we did it and that's the only way I would believe it. Neither one of them is sentimental and slow moving, it's not a normal courtship. It's just sparks. And if you're afraid the Myrtle Joe Casta relationship is just a one time deal, don't worry. The show has a lot more in store for this new couple. I can't wait for you guys to see where we're going with that relationship. We definitely kicked it off with a good start and you'll have to check in on season 5 to see where it goes. We have some interesting stuff planned, Graffia teased, adding that there's actually another scene with them that didn't make it in the cut that is going to be on the DVD, in the bonus features on the DVD. So there's a little bit more with them. They were wonderful together. They have a really cool chemistry, those two actors. We love them.